Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down another booster cracking Sunday, and we are finishing up the rest of this box. Forgot what we were opening for a second. The Moonlit Savior, which we uh, started opening up last week. We got a God Pack. Go check out that video if you haven't seen it. It's pretty cool. We got some nice pulls in there, but I don't think we're done yet. I think we can find some good stuff in here still. I don't think our luck has run out yet. So let's get in to opening the rest of these. All right, first one, here we go. All right, we got that bird, Lunar Lake, a nice looking wolf, uh, time space time anomaly, and that's the uncommon, where's our rare? There's our rare, we got uh, Maribel something machine, self-aware machine, a light magic stone, and on the back, ooh, that's a nice full art, all right. I don't think he's worth anything, but keeper of the seal. He looks sweet as a full art, I'll give him that. So I heard a rumor floating around on all the Force of Will discussion boards, things like that, that uh, mainly your J rulers or your good pulls are always gonna be on the left-hand side of the box here, about three to four to five packs down. That's where they say all your luck comes into play. So I'm gonna start testing that theory and see if that's correct. I'm not sure if it is. Here's our rare memory of disappearance, a nice orb of disaster as another rare behind it. And then we've got uh, Ferment of the World Tree as our rare. I think this one in a full art goes for a few bucks. Pulling one from the middle, you know, we, we're gonna save that left side for more of the middle of the video or something, just in case, just in case. Oh, we're showing off the end. Can't show off the end now. Uncommon, and there's our rare World Tree Protector. A nice looking foil darkness magic stone, looks beautiful. And a Drill Sergeant rare. I haven't seen this card yet. Eh. All right, all right, into the next pack. Let's do this thing. We'll keep on rolling on through. We can go a little faster now, can't we? Yeah, all right, get to the rare. There's our rare Knight of Solstice, pretty cool. A Heavenly Instrument, a Hydromonica as our rare behind that. And then we've got a hey, Knight of Solstice as our foil, non full art though. Keep it coming. We've got a Temple Monk on the front, beautiful looking card there. And we got some fairies, some cool demon flames. That was not a rare, wait, was that rare? No, that wasn't uncommon. This is our rare, it's Maribel again. A wind magic stone foil, and then rhythm of life common. Little phantom T-Rex going on in there, interesting. All right, we're pulling from the left, we're pulling from the left. Now I'm guessing our god pack was the pack on the left, but I had, I'll had. i have to go back and recheck that. But you never know, maybe the left side is just lucky. Lucky left. That's what we're going to call it. And we got Demonic Commander as our rare. Behind that, a Water Magic Stone. And then, bam, well, there's your left side right there. A full art J ruler of Time Arsonist or Arsonist Alasaurus. Alarasis. Alarasasasasasasasas. There's the reverse. Not bad. And then full art J rula. Very nice. Very, very nice. All right. Lucky left side. That was pretty good. But now we're going to go on the right. Rough right. Let's see if we get a common foil here, then it is the rough right. Let's see what we can get from the right side. All right, Maribel again, that's our third one like in a row. Excalibur behind it though, that's not bad. And behind that we've got Space Time Collapse. It is a rare foil, so I don't know, I don't know. Back to the middle. Middleman, middleman. What are we gonna find in the middle? Let's go get through these a little bit quicker here. We've got, that's an uncommon, oops, there we go. And there's our rare, Space Time Collapse, which we just got in that foil. A nice foil light magic stone. I think in some of these older sets, you're like guaranteed a foil in each of the stones or something, because we're like hitting all of them. Foil Mary Bell, all right. <laughs> That's crazy. We've gotten a lot of her. I'll be honest, I know some people like her character. It's one of my least favorites, honestly. Little Maribel. I don't know. It doesn't do anything for me. I don't really like her costume design. It's not that interesting. Uh, and that's what I go off of. I just go off the art. Memory of Disappearance. That's our rare. And then we've got Hymnal's Memoria, which isn't a foil or anything, but you never know. We'll look it up. If there's no price, then it's not worth anything. And Fairy. Moonbreeze Fairy Common. If you hadn't noticed, that's kind of what I'm doing now. I'm uh, just to save myself some time on some of these older sets that aren't really valued very highly on a lot of the cards. If you don't see a price on a rare or anything like that, it's usually because it's under like 50 cents. If it's above 50 cents, I might try to put it, but uh, 
yeah, a lot of these are not. So we've got Keeper of the Pest, Yurthar, which I want to get in a full art. That'd be really cool. And Wind Magic Stone. And, ooh, that's a nice one. Nice foil space-time anomaly. I like that, but I think we're going to need to get in a full art to really solidify the value on this one so yeah in the past i used to have it like my cap off point was like under 30 cents if it was under a 30 cent card i wouldn't mark it i'm raising that a bit to save myself some time again so yeah 50 cents or lower i'm just not gonna put the price up i'm just gonna start calculating from like 50 cents up or something another demonic commander not bad and let's see demonic globe of the earth non-foil though we've already gotten that memory of disappearance not a full art, but I think this one had like 60 cents or something on it. I forget. Left side. Left side. What will you give us this time? Let's see. All right. We've got some fun little commons. We got that ghost dinosaur. Uh, Valentina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's our rare ferment of world tree. Not a foil. Light magic stone. And boom. Yeah. Need the full art, but I'll take the foil. We got the regular version of her, and now we have the foil version of Avatar of the Seven Lands. Alice, this is a phenomenal looking card. I love the artwork on this one. Really want a full art. And in this set, you know, it's just the full arts that are really valued at a lot of stuff from when I was pricing on the last vi uh, video. It was it was just the full arts that was basically it that had any value. So this one's took a dive. This one's an interesting card. This one must have seen a lot of play because this one did have some value in just regular foils even. Uh, but that is our rare, our bamboo rare foil. And we must have missed our rare. Oh no, we had the ferment. All right, yep, there we go. No big deal. Let's keep moving on. Wow, I feel like I just gave myself a burn ripping that pack ow something didn't feel right almost felt like a burn and then i was like did i give myself a paper cut i don't know what happened there anyways i'm fine i'm fine don't worry about me all right darkness magic stone and then we've got peasant revolt common foil left side i think we're a little too deep for it to be lucky anymore but we'll see maybe it'll give us some good stuff still you never know but we're gonna breeze on through this get past the bondage and the bunny and we're going to see our rare Shion's Hymn, which I don't think we've gotten yet. Black Moon's Memorial, which this one has some value in a foil version, but I'm not sure about just the regular. And then Shade Knight, just a common. Ooh, buddy, we are down to our last three packs. One on the right here that we're opening, one in the middle and one on the left. So can we pull out one more big hit before we leave this video? Skipping cards a little bit. That's okay. World Tree Protector. Oh, that was our rare. And then we've got uh, the Noble again, Tuka Sonomi, which would love to get a full art in, but I don't know if that's possible anymore. Pitch Black Moon Uncommon. All in all, it's been a decent box, and we got that God Pack, which really helped, because if we didn't have that God Pack, I don't know if we would have made any money back on this one, uh, but it has been a fun box. Will I get this one again? Probably not. I'm not a huge fan of this set. It's all right. Um, Keeper of the Present. Yep, she's a cool card. Fire Magic Stone. And ooh, that's a nice one to get. Love that. Celestial of Music Full Art, which is a beautiful card. I did want to get this in a full art because just look at that artwork. That is fantastic. Artwork in a full art looks phenomenal. It does have, I want to say, a buck or two value. I don't think it goes over two, but we'll see. Last pack. Here we go. What will we find? in the left lucky pack side let's go come on now oh uh, 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 can't grab it can't do it we got the dragon we got the drill oh is that a rare that is a rare drill sergeant is a rare yadrazel's memoria that's a good one and veteran master common foil yeah what are you gonna do all right pulls of the day we didn't get a whole lot in the second half but we did get some decent stuff uh just a couple things but space time anomaly i don't know if it's got value being it's not the full art but we'll see uh this guy probably not. i just threw him in because he is one of our full art pulls that we got Al avatar of the seven lands i believe again not really going to hold a lot of value unless it's a full art but hey we did get celestial of music which should hold some value and then of course we got our other j ruler but this time the full art we got him in the god pack but it wasn't the full art i believe so good pull from this one hopefully you guys enjoyed this box stay tuned i've got something else coming up here 
I got some Alice Origin. I got the first of the Alice Origin sets. Uh, just got this in, so I'm excited to open this one up. It's one of the small packs. It's 20 packs in the box, so we're gonna open it up all in one go. Uh, so if you're looking forward to that, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, stay tuned for that. We're gonna do that next week. And yeah, price is up on screen for how we did overall with this box though here. I think we still made our money back. It was about a $40 box, something like that, $35, $40. So not too shabby. Leave a like, subscribe. Thank you for the support and we will see you guys in the next one.